so hey guys welcome back and today i will be exploring um, dashboard which is based on sample superstore data set so uh, i have used power bi to create this dashboard i have also used um, tableau to make all this project and uh, i will show you that as well so as you can see that we have some data sources here and then I have created the, this dashboard using all these functions. So in this video, we are not going to uh, look at what are those things, which uh, how we build it, but I will uh, upload a video where I will show you that how I created a whole dashboard. But if you do like, please do comment if you want the whole uh, tutorial video that how I, I did create all these things. So let's get started and let's have a look on this. So first thing we can see that in the whole data set, we have almost 793 customer and then 5,009 ordered placed. And then we have uh, 0.29 million profit we have almost gained by selling 2.30 million of our sales. And uh, we can see the average delivery date means uh, how much, how much uh, time we need to deliver the uh, the product to the customer so that is uh, almost four days and then we can see a small um, forecasting that how the things gonna happen in upcoming time and then <clears throat> We have few filters here like region, central, east, south, and west, and then we have state. We can select any state, and that all state are from uh, United States. And then we have some categories, furniture, offices, and technologies. And then we have uh, here a donut chart. That is a um, uh, uh, two donut chart and one in each other. And then we have top products. So you can see that Canon has the top product having the most sales. And you can see that uh, the red is, uh, color is showing the loss, right? So the Cisco tele, tele uh, prison systems sells almost uh, sells almost 22,000 sales, but it has also uh, the loss. So that is minus and that's why it's red. And the top customer is overall the top customer is Shane Miller, but he has some kind of sales he does but he has some uh, loss and that's why it's red in color and we can see the discount versus sales and you can see that as we increase our discount up to uh, 20 percent we can see that our sales decrease but we as we increase our uh, discount then our sales increases and so on and then we can see a heat map heat map showing that what product sold more sold most according to this and if there is a red red tint so it means it has loss and you can see the sales versus profit so you can see the table like more we sell table more we uh, have to face the loss and we can see all these things now let's try to figure out let's try to talk uh, more only for furniture and then we will talk one by one so if i just click on the furniture now whole the uh, everything will be converted only for furniture so we can see that for furniture we have 700 customer who has placed order for furnitures and then for furniture we have 1764 ordered placed and this profit and to deliver the furniture we need 3.9 almost uh, less than four days actually so that is how we think so and we can see the forecasting we can see that the um, uh, there is a sudden depth uh, in the sale of furniture so we can expect um, recession in the furniture sales and the top selling product is HON series task chair which sells most almost and it has zero profit and then we have something called uh, chrome craft bull nose wood oval conference table that has the maximum loss okay and the top customer we can see here the top customer and discount versus sale we can see the discount versus sale here so we can see here 10 percent discount 15 percent discount we can see here and then we have 20 percent discount at the 20 percent discount we have maximum sales so as we increase more discount uh, not much sales instead of loss and now we can see that uh, chair has the maximum profit in furniture category 
and then furnishing has the maximum profit in the category and in the table we can see that we sell more table but we have much loss so i think if we have if i would own this business i would probably think about tables and bookcases why do we have all these kind of loss and particularly i will uh, i will look at the chrome craft uh, oval table that why we have so much loss in this particular product we will talk about that and then you can see that in furnishing we don't sell much furnishing we don't sell much furnishing but we have uh, enough profit in that right you can see that uh, this this uh, uh, light blue line shows me sales so in furnishing we have not much sales but we have enough profit so we can say that the furnishing have maximum margin and in table category, we can see that the table has um, much sales, but we are facing only loss. So I would stop selling tables or I would definitely think about it that what else we can do uh, particularly about that. So in office supplies, we can see all these things same and uh, all these things. So hope you like this video. And if you really like this video, please give me a like uh, on video. And if you want a particular tutorial video that how I, I build all these things uh, together. So please do write a comment and we'll, I will make a, uh, other uh, video where I will be explaining each and every um, um, cards, each and every graphs. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.